Well, people don't have to follow my footsteps, but anybody who wants to be a scientist or an art artist or a mathematician or a writer, whatever, you have to work hard. You have to put your heart and soul to it. There has to be a lot of riyas, a lot of practice, a lot of exercise for everything. To, uh, the idea is not the name of fame. The idea is the pleasure of painting, and that is the main thing. Which was one aha moment or epiphany in your life that made you choose this career path? Right from my childhood, I suppose every human being is talented in one thing or the other. You are good in mathematics, I'm zero in mathematics, but I'm good in painting. And these are God-gifted, inherent, your DNA. So that talent, what's happening in our society, in our country, in our families, we do not encourage our children to take up what they are talented in. <laughs> So the talent has to be scouted for, the talent has to be nurtured, and after nurturing you have to do a lot of practice, a lot of riyas, and you have to devote your life to it, then only it happens. Unfortunately, our parents are pushing their children to do commerce and IT only. Or earlier they used to say, go for medicine or engineering or administrative service. So each one of us are talented, each human being is creative, so that is how it starts at home. The brother, sister, parents have to encourage. Then in the school, school also has to guide. And then the children should take up. But the basic foundation of poetry, painting, music, dance has to be there. What or who has this inspiration? Uh, many people, many people of different periods of... India is a unique country. You can think of centuries. Of, uh, you can think of Kalidas, you can think of the temples and sculptures and uh, the great Siviraman scientists, and the many, many things. We have many role models in our country. So you have to think of them. The idea is not everybody is thinking of achieving and to get an award, to get a prize, to get the money. That's not the purpose of creativity. It's to enjoy what you are doing. Mm. What makes you creatively think? What do you do when you reach a Every human being have huddles and blocks. Some, some periods, certain times are there where you, everything opens up for you. Sometimes its doors are closed. This is a way of nature. Because it's like it's hot, then it will be monsoon, then it will be winter and things will happen. So there is a, there is a um, you know, cyclic order of nature. Likewise for creativity. Today's youth is willing to experiment with different hobbies and careers. Yeah. What is your perspective on this? Uh, I think children should try out everything, then choose their path uh, uh, thereafter, channelize themselves into one thing. But at the same time, you have to be a good human being, you have to be a good person in the society. At the same time, you have to pursue your creativity. Creativity is not only painting. Mathematics can be creative, physics can be also creative. In your opinion, what is the need of the art for art as an industry field or career in our country? This uh, concept, taking art as a career, is a very commercial word. Uh, you don't take it as a career, you t not as a profession, but it's you pursue it because of your inherent talent. Uh, it's, a, it's a lifelong journey. Uh, but everybody in the family, in the society, people are talking of, you must do a career, you must buy a Maruti car, you must get a telephone, and those kind of things. And uh, the idea, uh, I don't know. We are, we are producing middle level rubber stamp people. But this country, even when the country was not very affluent, people had a lot of creative people were there, great poets, great writers, great sculptors who build their temples, you know. Mm. In today's day and age, what are the values that today's youth must possess to succeed in the field of art? Ethics, dignity, value, uh, 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 riyas, practice, uh, to work. If you want to sing, sing every day for four hours, five hours, do saregama. 
if you want to paint then do sketching every day for 5 10 hours so that's they no other shortcut if you had to give one word of advice to our audience especially the youth audience what would that message be just enjoy life and work just work hard in whatever you are interested in. thank you very much